Oh, this is impossible. What, what is that? This is a very quick sound test of the Audio-Technica ATR3350 lapel microphone. It's one of the cheaper lapel microphones on the market, it retails for about 20 quid. And it's not a bad microphone, it's quite good. Uh, I did a comparison between this and the Speedlink Spez microphone, which retails for about £7. You can go and watch that review somewhere around here, wherever it is now, YouTube's probably changed it again. Uh, this microphone doesn't need plug-in power or anything because um, it comes with this little battery pack. There's a little battery inside. There's a switch there where you can turn it on and off. I always forget to turn it off. Uh, it comes with a little windscreen if you want. If you want to use that, you can just stick it on there. I'm, I'm not... Oh, yeah, there you go. Well, I mean, it's on-ish. Between this and the Speedlink Spares, I think... I mean, it depends on you, because we might have different ears, but... This is about £13 more, but I, th I think, personally, it's worth it. It's worth paying that that bit extra, because it seems to sound better. The Speedlink Spares has probably got a lot of noise compared to this, and this doesn't require plug-in power, so you don't need... A, I mean, I'm using it with the Zoom H4 right now. It doesn't need plug-in power or anything like that, whereas the Speedlink Spares does. Um, I think that's about all I've, all I've got to say about it. I just waffled on then, so that you could get an idea of what it sounds like. Uh, good. So, there we go. That's the Audio-Technica ATR3350. There's a link in the description to where you can buy it on Amazon. Check the price now, because it might have changed since I last looked. It might have gone up or down, or be the same. Good. Bye-bye.